right, y'all, we have a video of a Popeye's employee in Atlanta who called the police on a customer for trying to buy food for a homeless person, and that's going viral. Take a look. I can't order for this homeless man right here who asked for food. Her initial disbelief that employees wouldn't let her buy a two-piece for the man experiencing homelessness. They called the cops on me, everything, bro. Quickly turned into anxiety when the cop showed up. So the customer eventually spoke to the general manager of the store who felt awful about the situation and did eventually allow her and the homeless man to order anything they wanted that night for free. Uh, let's start with you, Al. What, what do you think about this story? It's, it's perfectly correct. <laughs> there are 70 states in the United, I'm sorry, 70 cities in the United States that it's illegal to buy homeless people food. All right, that's Philadelphia, Fort Lauderdale, Houston, Tampa and Atlanta. So if you live in Atlanta, you cannot just buy a homeless person food. You have to obtain a permit and a, or, or a permit is required to give meals to the homeless. And they just instituted that in 2017. How evil of, of a lawmaker do you have to be to like put that even like make that into a bill? Like, let's make it illegal to do this, to give, to buy food. I understand maybe making something, you don't know, you don't trust where that's coming from, but to buy something from a place that's been cleared and has license, you know what I mean? To operate business. That's odd. Aki, what do you think about this? That's the dumbest crock of SHIT I've ever heard. I'm going to be honest with you. I highly doubt that woman at Popeye's was educated enough to know that that's the law. In my personal opinion, I feel like she was being nasty. Um, just maybe because the man probably hangs out around that parking lot. Like, Al, that's why I love that you being on this show because you bring a perspective that, you know, you do the research and stuff. That what you just told me, I didn't even know that existed. I'm more than sure her $12 an hour making ass didn't know that law existed either. And here's the thing that got me. The fact that you work at Popeye's, baby, you $2 away from being homeless your own damn self. So you think you have some empathy for the doggone man. Like what? And, and, and even if, even if she was aware of the doggone law, how many laws do we all break on a daily basis? You know what I'm saying? What would it have cost you to let that lady order that two piece and slang it out the window? It, it, it actually would have sped your drive through lineup much quicker to just let the lady buy the damn two piece. You were being nasty and God sees everything. And that's why your ass work at Popeye's. And where's, where's the humanity? You know, like forget buying food for the homeless people. We throw away like almost 50, 40 percent of the food that we make. Like there's so much food that goes to waste every single day in America, especially in America. And all these people on the street, homeless and hungry and need something to eat. All right, y'all, we're going to take a quick commercial break. Our last break, and we will be right back with TGIF. Make sure you get your questions in for Al and Q and myself, and we'll be right back. 